how to create this type of dual tone effect in Premiere Pro. Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Monday FX. In today's video, we are going to talk about how you can create dual tone effect in single video or in single footage. <clears throat> like you can see here, uh, we have like you can see here we have a dual tone effect in one video. Uh, on my left hand side there is orange type tone and on the right hand side we have a green type tone or greenish tone. Uh, this is the one clip there is no another clip of no another uh, lighting this is the post production work or this is the simple effect you can create with uh, premiere pro or you can uh, achieve with premiere pro so without any further ado let's get started this effect is totally inspired by music video love to lose uh, you can see the uh, dual tone effect in this music video so we will create this type of effect in the Premiere Pro uh, in today's episode. So you can see in my timeline I have taken one raw footage. Uh, this is the night scene of room. And we have some uh, greenish tone or bluish tone uh, in the room. So we will create dual tone effect in the same clip. For that you have to simply uh, duplicate your layer. Uh, press alt and then drag your, uh, drag your video on the second track. Like we have same video on uh, both track on video track 1 and video track 2. Uh, so we have to apply very simple effect which is color balance HLS. So simply uh, search for this effect color balance and here it is. Uh, simply apply this effect on your upper clip like we have applied uh, but there is no correction or no effect is applied because, because every value is set on 0. So we have to change some parameters. Simply go to color balance effect and here we have three options like hue, lightness and saturation. Simply increase the value of hue like real color. On, 50, on 54 degree or 54 percentage you can see here. We have the value like uh, we have uh, like we have yellowish tone in our room and you can change it whatever you want. Like I have uh, set it to green and that's it. So for that you have to for that you have to set hue value on 280 degree like uh, I have set it so now you can see that there is a greenish tone in our video so we have to adjust some of the parameters also like lightness and saturation by the lightness you can by the lightness you can adjust the lightness or uh, intensity of the effect or intensity of the hue we have applied on the, on the clip so simply if you increase the lightness then you can see that here is the faded effect created but we don't want it so simply decrease the lightness value a little bit you can set minus 1 or minus 2 In the saturation part you can increase or decrease the value of saturation but uh, if we decrease the value of saturation uh, it decreases the all the color from our clip so we don't need what we need is to uh, we we will increase some of the value of saturation like uh, 10 10 or 20 it's totally depend on your clip or uh, it's totally depend on you what type of effect you want to create or uh, what's in your mind so simply i like uh, i set the value of saturation to 25 if you toggle on of the effect you can see the original video or original clip like we have applied greenish tone on our clip you can see and this is our uh, original video for creating dual tone effect we have to create a mask on our second track video for that simply uh, for that simply choose any shape layer or you can uh, draw with free draw bezier tool or with pen tool simply click this or draw your mask Now you can see that I have created a mask on our uh, layer or on our effect. But here we can't notice a major difference in this clip. So we have to change the value of hue also uh, again. So we can set the tone like yellowish tone or a, a different tone from blue. Like if I if I set to yellow or if I uh, set the value of uh, 200. 
so if i set the value of hue to 230 so you can achieve this uh, effect like yellow stone some of uh, you can set the value of lightness or decrease the value of lightness increase the value of lightness but uh, we don't want anything but uh, you can set the value of saturation or adjust the uh, value of saturation also the value of saturation the value of hue saturation lightness is totally depend on your clip or totally depend on your lighting in your clip in your video in your footage so you can uh, play with them like you can see that here is the sharp edges uh, we can see so you can blend it by increasing value of feather like 20 or set the value of 20 add or more so you can blend with you can play with them also because we want to create a sharp dull tone effect in our video in our footage if you decrease the value of hue to 150 or 160 you can achieve the reddish tone in our clip don't forget to adjust the value of lightness and saturation because we have to match some of the uh, color or some of the effects some of the shadows the highlights we have we have to work on them so this is totally depend on your clip on your footage After applying the effect, you can render the um, effect or you can render the clip by selecting the in and out point. And that's it. Here our final result uh, that we have added a dual tone effect in, in our footage. You can play the video and see the result. Like we have added dual tone in same clip. Uh, some of some of the footage might not support this effect so we have to apply the lumetri color panel or lumetri effect on our clip we have to some of the we have to adjust some of the colors in our clip so for that you can check out the previous tutorial on our uh, channel or from the, from the card section that how you can that how you can change the tone of your video or how to convert your uh, video in a single tone uh, with lumetri color options or lumetri color effect so that is for today guys in this episode we have created dual tone effect in premiere pro and this effect is inspired by music video love to lose and uh, you can see that hope you like the video and learn something new from this tutorial if yes please share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel so goodbye for today catch you in the next episode bye bye peace and be a good observer